finally got my pellet stove working like a charm. If you can really see. But it's not raging, it's just glowing. And it's full of pellets. And uh, that's the first time I've had to do that. And I got this little, but I can't see. Let me see. Yeah. I got a little stone insert. And that keeps the pellets back. And then, this is all made out of pavers from Lowe's. So here you got $2 paver, $2 paver, 50 cent brick, 50 cent brick, 50 cent brick. It's all, total was like $200. Inside here is just an open chamber with like the top of a grill, like a portable barbecue grill. And kind of filling out the top of the chamber. And then earth and stone and concrete all up on top of that. The whole thing probably weighs 800 pounds. And I'm going to add more. I uh, can't really see. Got to add more stone back here. More bricks and stuff on the top. But Cat likes it. She likes to sit beside it. Anyway, then there's a chimney. So all this was two hundred dollars. Lowe's. This was six hundred dollars just to install to buy it, and then eight hundred to install it. So it was like twelve hundred dollars for a stupid chimney. But it's got a space up there, so it's not touching anything. And it's safer that way. But yeah, I mean it's just rocking, and this is it's warm right here. Warm right there, and it's just starting to burn. So, you could make one of these for cheap if you didn't have to buy the expensive pipe. Uh, maybe you already have a pipe or something running, and you could buy, you could build one of these for damn near nothing 200 bucks. So, this is a big stone paver here, and then this is a little like the whole bottom is fire bricks. So, I just went to Lowe's and I stacked up. Cinder block, cinder block, cinder block. And then I stacked up paver, paver, pavers. You know, made a little box of pavers. You know, a little piece of paper lighting up in there. And I gotta finish out the front of it and stuff. There's like a shelf. Gotta add more to it. And then there's a glass brick. Gotta add more around that. Like bricks and stuff. But yeah, I mean, keeps the house warm, super cheap. Anybody can make one. There's a tiny little hole at the top of the chamber in the back, so the draw starts. But then the air mostly comes in from the bottom straight back through the same size square hole. And the combustion chamber here. So it's a combination of a masonry stove and a rocket stove. You can literally stick wood straight in the hole and burn it. <coughs> and then feed the wood in there as you as it burns. And so everybody should make one. I don't know. I invented it, but the rocket mason stove get you one.